Mundane Man here again and out on a September afternoon slash evening for a little uh, rip on the quad. It's the first day of fall and I thought uh, what a good way to celebrate the, uh, the, the coming of fall. Now I'm at uh, the Blue Rapids uh, recreational area. It's uh, over near Drayton Valley. I hope you can hear me in the wind. Just a nice evening to uh, mosey around in the, in the quad. Unfortunately, when I got here, I noticed that this area was really hit by wildfire this uh, spring, I would assume. I haven't been here for two or three years. I'm pretty sure that this was part of the, the May wildfires that we had here in uh, central Alberta. Makes quite a mess of everything and it's unfortunate. All the trees uh, burnt up or blackened. Some of them looked like they were pretty old trees too, especially some of the, uh, the larger pine trees that uh, you can't see here, but in deeper into the, uh, the forest, uh, there's uh, some nice big trees that are all uh, burnt up. There's a, one here. That was a fairly big tree too. The trunk is all blackened. I assume that's actually gonna kill the tree eventually background noise of, with the wind and also this pump jack are uh, accompanying me on my uh, video today. Those things are ugly and noisy. Making lots of money though I suppose for someone. I have been riding for an hour or so already and it's been uh, quite enjoyable. Beautiful weather, must be 20 degrees and uh, despite the uh, burnt up trees it's still uh, beautiful out here. It smells like a constant campfire, which eh, nothing wrong with that. I did check the uh, Alberta web page uh, for Alberta parks and make sure there was no fire bans or anything out here, and there isn't. Um, again, I think I mentioned that the biggest danger they warned of is any burnt up trees could end up uh, falling over, so you gotta be cautious of that, especially in areas where they haven't done an, as much cleanup. I'm going to hop back on the quad, do a few more uh, miles, and check out what else is out here. So let's get at it.
little bit scared about going down that hill and then through that mud hole. When I'm out here by myself, um, I try not to take any chances because uh, it's a long walk back to the truck usually and doesn't seem to be too many people out here tonight. I've seen, well, just one dirt biker, I guess. So let's keep riding. That last area I went through where they uh, looks like they had to replace all the power lines is usually pretty marshy and I was able to zip through there without any trouble there was hardly any uh, soft spots at all so just proves how dry this area has gotten over the years
that fan on my quad getting loud. Might be time to replace it. It's almost been that, that since brand new, but what are you gonna do? Well, here we are down at the beautiful North Saskatchewan River near Drayton Valley. Just a beautiful evening tonight. But I think it's time to head back. It's uh, getting close to 7 o'clock. Sun will be setting in about a half hour or 45 minutes. So time to end this trip. loaded up ready to head home sun is getting pretty low out there and I gotta get home before dark because I think I got a taillight burnt out on the trailer and I'm hoping to please take kindly to that so that's it for this edition of mundane man where I was at Blue Rapids recreation area and spent a couple hours here on uh, some of the trails and went down to the river and such pretty good place to come um, I know I haven't explored all of it for sure go away mosquitoes and uh, I'm sure I'll be back again to to do some more exploring so that's it for this edition of Mundane Man thanks for watching and don't forget to like comment subscribe and all those good things and we'll catch you on the next one bye bye